My name is Jeremy Foley. Our project is Mom's This is the Call of Duty, Jim Bedditon, Chris Titone. Um, right now, our website is Funny or Die. Yeah, that's, that's what we're posting. Yeah. Okay. Um, what's the secret to group harmony on set? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Like 20 years between us, so we like to a little for the record. But I mean, you know what the chemistry shows are how can we make it? It all comes out and you can see that we're really actually close. Yeah. When you work with your best friends, you can do anything. The way I look at it is we all uh, get together and have fun with it because there's going to be a time in our lives where studios are going to tell us what to do. So we get to get together and do what we want and it's great. So. Yeah. We have a lot of fun doing it. I mean, when just us hanging out, we should have a camera on us just because we're, yeah. you know, we're quick with each other, making fun of each other. Exactly. One day we put a camera on. Yeah. I mean, we can film yeah. 20 episodes. Yeah. 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 So, um, anyway, the web series is called Mobsters. It's on Funny or Die. The episode up for uh, the award is episode one where it starts Brian Austin Green. He plays himself and he's going out for a role to play here. a mobster. So to really get the role down, he hangs out with the mobster. It's real a mobster. Yeah, we try to show him how this so kind of tackles the whole method out there. He goes on a ride along with these guys and kind of uh, discovers what it is to be a mobster. And actually, we got our, our latest episode out right now, episode five, on uh, Funny or Die. Uh, who do we got for next, next episode is Alan Coburn. He plays Grandma's Boy in the movie Grandma's Boy. Okay. And then after that, we have Jamie Lynn Siegler, who is uh, Anna Soprano. I'm like, I'm like, what? I want to know for actors, what's the biggest obstacle within your entire day? Like, face the computer, you're looking for breakdowns. What is it? What is the thing that, oh, that you most actor, procrastinate? I'll tell you exactly what it is. I think it's me. Yeah, yeah. When you work with a guy like this. No, no, no. You know what it is? It's, it's for an actor, I think the biggest obstacle would be the And I think it happens a lot. And I think actors out there should just accept it. That, that happens. Change out of battery. And as long as you keep going and you keep moving forward, I think that there's a chance. That's the biggest obstacle. It's overcoming yeah. the rejection. So I've been doing I agree. It 17 years. Yeah. I agree. Having a short memory. Um, you know, you know, that didn't work out, but just to change looking forward and having a really short memory. That's the hardest thing to pull off. But if you do pull that off, you're pretty cool. If I could tell an actor two things, I'd say go to your audition off, and after it's done, that's the only two things I'd say. I work a nine to five job. I don't know what acting is. This guy, he sounds like a great this guy. Is I guy. Love this is the reason why we're all here. It's true. He's our hustler. It's all he may work a nine to five. He's just this guy with no staff. Jimmy Shoulders. And our fearless, our fearless yeah, director. Director. Uh, 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 I'm, 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 wait, what the? What the? Uh, just me. Just me. Jeremy. All right. Thank you. Thank you.